So my name is Amir Reichman. I'm a biotechnology engineer by uh, training and joining BioNVax now as the new CEO, coming directly from GSK vaccines in Belgium. I've been working for GSK in the past six years in the senior leadership roles, global engineering, vaccines, and global supply chain of vaccines. I was responsible globally for asset management worldwide. Prior to that, I was part of the global vaccine supply chain management uh, leadership team, where I was responsible for process development, co compliance, performance management, and uh, other practices of global supply chain. Prior to G GSK, I was working in North America, in the United States, for Novartis vaccines, again in global supply chain. And prior to that, I was part of the founding team of Neuroderm, sold to Mitsubishi Tanabe Pharma for $1.1 billion in 2017. I wouldn't have left a, a fantastic job that I had with GSK that I so admire and love to work for, unless I saw such an amazing opportunity here at Bionvax. When I look at Bionvax, it's uniquely positioned versus its competitors. This is a fairly small company with fantastic capabilities, clinical development experience with seven clinical trials, phase one and phase two. And then in, in the first phase three clinical trial conducted over seven countries, 105 hospitals, and approximately 12,400 participants. For a company at the size of Biovax, this is an uncomparable experience. Combine that with having our own manufacturing site, brand new, that can manufacture 10 to 40 million doses per year. This is, again, it's, it's a unique situation. And this, this asset, also bring a lot of processes. This company knows how to manufacture it, good manufacturing practices, GMP, quality management system, QA, QC labs, and processes. These are things that you don't see in such small markup companies. So when I looked at that, it looked to me as a fantastic opportunity. And I really wanted to come and bring my own vision and mission for this company and realized that that could be a fantastic platform to make my dream come true and really create a big pharma company focused on infectious diseases, both prophylactic and therapeutic here in Israel. First thing I've done after joining BioNVAX was to define together with the board and the excellent team of leadership here, the next mission and vision and then strategy to become a global player in the infectious diseases area, providing both prophylactic and therapeutic solutions. So creating a complete pipeline of both vaccines and therapies for infectious diseases. When we discussed it, suddenly everybody got really excited about that because we do not want to come back and become, again, a product-focused company rather than a company that aspires to achieve a mission, giving the rounded solution for infectious diseases, both prophylactic and therapeutic. We see ourselves in five years from now playing in the, in the global arena as a reliable and trusted supplier and manufacturer and developer of solutions for infectious diseases. And so to do that, we'd like to create a pipeline of assets that will provide investors with diversification opportunities along different axes. One is time to market. So we'll try to li in license products with different time to market at different stages of development. The second thing would be to, to go after prophylactic and therapeutics, not only providing a full rounded solution for infectious diseases, but also allowing investors to diversify risk between vaccines and biological therapeutics. The other axis would be platforms. We'll try to create few platforms, such as viral vector, for example, or uh, recombinant proteins or an antibody, so that we end up with few platforms out of which we can spin out and generate 
new products that will serve as a pipeline of products that will come into market. We were very thankful for the trust from investor community. And now that we have approximately $15 million, we can go now and find new opportunities for in-licensing, collaboration, and, and potentially joint ventures. So after defining our mission, our vision, and the strategy to pursue this vision and to, uh, to make it come true, we created a list of potential technologies and assets we'd like to in-license and bring in-house into BioNVAX. And then we narrow down and zoomed in on those particular assets that we would like to start and do due diligence on. Our team immediately lined up behind this uh, strategy. And so in the, what you will be expecting us in the next months would be to see a company focused on business development, conducting due diligence on key assets that we would like to in-license. And we hope and we really hope to have very good news in the next few months.